Hey, thank you for that, Chris. Been on to our weekly feature, Smart Farm, and the government has embarked on a project to promote the use of certified cotton seeds to small-scale farmers in the country. Through the Kenya Agricultural and Livestock Research Organization, CalRO, the government is set to introduce the first-ever cotton seeds system to produce the certified cotton seeds. The move is part of efforts to revive cotton farming in the country. Our very own Dennis Ocheno has more on this week's Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity. Saving for your farming goals is now easy with Equity. Whether you need to buy a tractor, a piece of land, an irrigation system or any other farming need, simply log on to Equity Mobile App or Equity Online and start saving today. Kusave ni rahisi na Equity. A breath of fresh air is sweeping across cotton fields in Busia County. Dennis Mapesa, a cotton farmer for nearly five years, has seen it all. Uh, the main cash crop is the pamba hapo awal. So, as a way to wali, to funza could lima pamba. Like in all of a sudden, your pamba, your uh, mambo na ukulima ika toeka. Sababu ya changamoto, ambazo walikuwa na zipitia. Wakipeleka mazao yao jinar, siku hizo tulikuwa na jinar ambayo ilikuwa na ilikuwa na siaga pamba. Mapesa is among few cotton farmers in Busia trying their hands on the certified cotton seed variety by the government. Tumezoa zile variety za kitambo. Hata wakati tulikuwa tunapanda, hata wezi spray, wezi fire, wezi yeka, hata wakati mingine tukwa tunayeka mbolea. Lakini sasa variety mpya hii lazima upandie polea weke mbolea kwa wakati uspray kwa wakati taka itunzwe ili si guzwe na mdudu wote wametuletea mbegu tunalima pamba na wametutafutia wanunuzi kama Rift Valley na Dika Cloth Mills wanakuja kuchukua sasa hivi tukiuza tukilima pamba ukipata hivi unaenda kuuza unapata pesa hapo hapo vile ilikuwa miaka za 60 huko sasa mkulima ana moyo wa kulima the Kenya Agricultural and Livestock Research Organization, CALRO, is working towards establishing the first ever certified cotton seed system in the country. CALRO is using the Busia Cotton Project as a template in its plans to increase yields. A certified seed refers to a seed of a prescribed standard of quality produced under a controlled multiplication scheme. Farmers would just get seed from the genary to plant. We never had a system of producing certified seed for farmers. And these same farmers were not practicing good agronomy, like spacing, weeding, crop protection. So they were losing yield with time. Small-scale farmers such as Mapesa and Okumu are key in Calrol's plans to produce a generation of certified cotton seeds. We did a feasibility study and out of that study we discovered what we already know but now we had stigma to do it, stamina to, to tackle the problems. One of them was seed production or provision of seed to farmers. Then there was capacity, capacity of both institutions and the farmers and the other one was the offloading of what the farmer produces. Benefits of certified seeds include higher resistance to disease and pest attack as well as good adaptation to recommended ecological zones. Today, in addition to the improved seeds, farmers are also sensitized on good agronomical practices. We believe that with time we are going to provide all our farmers with seed. In this project, they are going to set a seed, an entire seed system for us. The first one in the country, more than 100 years after seed was, after cotton was introduced. I think that is a real plus. The organization plans to grow more certified seeds from its centers across the country, but will be hoping to contract more farmers like Mapesa to take part in the process of multiplication. Denis Otieno, Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity.
Open a savings account today to achieve your farming goals, be it purchase of a tractor, piece of land, an irrigation system or any other farming need. Simply log on to Equity Mobile app or Equity Online and start saving today. Kusave ni rahisi na 